Hi, Linda Bowen here from StampingWithLinda.com, your cardiologist since 1997, helping you create cards from the heart. If you're joining me uh, because of the creative inking blog hop, Fall in Love with Fall, welcome. Uh, fall is probably my one of my favorite seasons here in Ohio. Um, and so I am going to be doing a creative fold card. This is a surprised um, date fold. Um, it was inspired um, by a challenge I recently did with my team and Lee submitted a card um, and I'm going to show you her card. Her card looked like so and it is a gatefold but then there is a surprise. There's like a pop-up greeting. So I want to show you how she created that. We are going to start with a piece of very vanilla. This measures four inches by five and a quarter. We're going to grab our Cajun craze and we are going to use um, the stamp set, which is a returning bundle from last holiday catalog. It is called Gathered Together. Now I'm just going to stamp the pumpkins down here and then I am going to use um, this greeting. This is from a new bundle and the stamp set is called Beautiful Autumn and it says my heart is grateful for you. So this is going to be the inside of our card but I want to show you the technique that I used um, when I was creating this. I am going to use um, my water painter and I am going to just go in and grab the ink that I stamped the pumpkins with with that aqua painter just to give a shadowing to um, those pumpkins. Now I can go directly into my ink pad if I want to get some darker um, highlights in that. So that's going to be the inside of our card. We're going to set that aside. Love the new uh, water painters. They come as a set of three. We're going to go ahead and leave that ink pad open. We're going to grab our Cajun craze and this measures five and a half by eight and a half and what we are going to do is we're going to score at the two and an eighth. Now I could do two and an eighth on the other side, but if I'm off just a fraction, it gives me a gap in my card that I don't like. So what I'm going to do is grab my bone folder, I'm going to burnish the edge, and then I'm just simply going to fold over the other side. That way I can butt it right up. This is a great way when you're using or making a gatefold. So there's my gatefold. I'm going to go in and grab that piece of very vanilla. I'm going to add my adhesive and place that inside my card. I've already taken my Gilded Autumn Designer Series paper. I've cut these at one and seven eighths and five and a quarter. And so I'm going to add some adhesive and put them on the flap. Well, of course, you know, when you don't want it to stick and you drop it, that's when it sticks really well. So I've got that side. I'm going to grab the other side and add some adhesive. Next what I'm going to do is I have a piece of that Cajun craze. This is two inches long and what I'm going to do is I'm going to first score at a quarter inch and then I'm going to cut it at a half inch. So it is half inch by two that I need, but because I needed that score line and it's very small, I scored it first. I'm going to grab that bone folder and I am going to be using um, glue dots. Now you could use um, the multi-purpose glue if you want. We've just got a small quarter inch 
score line that we need adhesive on. We don't want the adhesive to go over that score line, so you've got to be very careful. Again, probably liquid glue would work well with this, but I am choosing just to use glue dots. And so I'm going to flip my card around so the inside's here. I'm going to kind of eyeball and put this little flap in the middle and fold it down. I have taken my stitch rectangles and the very vanilla cardstock and I am going to grab my verse. This comes from, um, it says, Life is Better With You and this is from the beautiful Autumn set that is a new bundle um, in our mini catalog. So I have that and I'm simply going to go onto that flap, kind of eyeball so that it's in the middle and put it down. So I've got this. Again, this is called a surprised gatefold. I'm next going to take another uh, stitch rectangle that I have already um, die cut out. I'm going to use the season of thanks, uh, my words. This is from that gather together bundle that has returned. And I've already taken the pumpkins, both the big and the large, um, and die cut them out. And we're going to add them to that rectangle. I'm also going to take the small one. I am going to use a dimensional to pop that out. Next, what I have already done is I have used the polished metal metallic, yeah, po polished metallic um, cardstock that is in the new mini, and I've cut that out with a rectangle, and I'm going to add my smaller rectangle with my verse to that. And then I'm going to put adhesive on that top part. And this is going to cover over that verse. So there you have a fun, surprised gatefold. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. Talk to you real soon. Bye-bye.